This is fire. This is fire. Woo. If you don't, let me know why. Hey you guys, welcome back to my channel. This is your girl IJ. If this is your first time being here, you are welcome to this video. You are welcome to my channel. I'm pleased that you stop by to watch this video. And if you're an OG, you know you are the best. Thank you so very much for all your support and thank you for stopping by for this video. So in this video, we are going to do an eyeshadow tutorial and you know I want to just give you guys the best. Something different, something powerful, something very vibrant and you know, all of this can tell for itself. So guys, if you want to see how I was able to achieve this eyeshadow tutorial, hey, even my husband said, hmm, that looks good. I was like, okay, I just nailed it. So guys, if you like this video, please give me a huge thumbs up. If you don't, let me know why. But I hope that you like it. So guys, if you want to see how I achieved this eyeshadow look, please keep watching and I'll talk to you guys at the end of the video. Let's jump right into it. Stay tuned. So I'm going to start by using this burgundy color from the Juvia's Place Saharan number no. 2 palette. This color is very very vibrant and it's so pigmented guys. If you haven't tried Juvia's Place before you need to jump on it. Like the colors, the, the pigments in the shade are so powerful. Just look at how burgundy and how sweet that color looks. Then I'm going to do the same thing. I'm just applying this color in my outer V. I want the view to pop out as much as possible. So that is what I'm doing here. I'm first of all packing in the colors just so that I get all the pigments. Then I'm going to jump into the Juvia's Place Zulu palette and I'm using this orange color right there and I'm packing that into my crease. I want that crease to stand out as well. You see how those two colors complement each other. That is what you want to do. Now then I'm going to use a clean blending brush and I'm going to go over those two colors and I'm just going to blend them all out. I want the edges to be as clean as much as possible. One thing with eyeshadow you need to understand is that you need to blend. In order to have your eyeshadow looking powerful and gorgeous, you want to learn how to blend. So just use a clean blending brush and you just blend out the edges and you will see the difference it makes. Then I'm going to go in with this yellow color and the yellow color is actually from the Zulu palette. I'm using that yellow color just to blend out the edges and to make everything come together and look as one. See how those three colors complement each other guys. It is powerful. Now I'm going to go in with this shimmery blue color. Oh my god, this was the best pick for the day. So I went in with that color on my lid and I was so excited I used this color. There was no other shade that I could have used for this color. Then I'm going to go in now with a black eye pencil. This is going to tie the in the look together guys black eye pencil is the deal now after applying the black eye pencil i am going to go in with that same burgundy color i'm going to um blend that at the bottom of my eyelid just towards the outer end and then towards the inner part of it i'm going to use that orange color you want to see that transition between the colors guys now if you see how blended that lower um eyelid is you'll be like oh my goodness how did this happen but exactly you are seeing what you are seeing guys there is no magic in this just blend out the thing and you are good see how that orange color blends with the burgundy color this is magic guys i just love the way this look actually came in um everything came in looking so beautiful then i'm going to tie in i'm going to tight line my eye um my eyelid by using this very black um eye eyeliner pencil i always i always miss the name it's an eyeliner pencil it's a liquid eyeliner and this is from the brand um one size if you haven't tried this pencil before you need to run right now to sephora and get yours this thing the tip of it is just so perfect it gives you, it gives you a very nice easy wing then i went in and i just dumped in some eyelashes and i was like whoa that was fire 
Now I am going in with my lips and I just wanted something very very soft, nothing too extraordinary because we want the focus to be on the eyes and the eyes was just everything. So I went in with a brown lip liner and then I'm going to use a nude shade at the center of my lips and this just made everything good. If my husband could say that was fire, then I could imagine what he was looking at. Then I can even imagine what you are looking at right now. I am just so excited the way this looks. Please, I want us to blow this video up. So share this video with your friends. Let us get as many likes as much as possible. And let us get as many shares as much as possible. Do not forget to leave a comment down below. I know most of you guys are watching these videos and not saying anything. And then I went into my, um, how do you call that spot again? I forgot to right there that is where i am going in with that green oh my god this was fire so guys this is the finished look i hope you guys still like this video hey it was fun creating this look honestly i love the way the colors complement each other this two palettes right here i just really love them this is from juvia's place so if you haven't tried this palette before please and you need some popping eyeshadow colors like some very vibrant colors you need to try this eyeshadow palette honestly i love them so very much and i haven't played with them so much anyway but anyway i'm so excited that i was able to do this look so if you do like this video please give me a huge thumbs up do not forget to like and subscribe to my channel and um, share with your friends as well thank you so much for all your support i'll talk to you guys in my next video until then stay blessed remember that you are the original there is no photocopy of you there is no counterfeit of you you are just the best take good care of yourself guys and stay blessed bye guys <laughs>